Do you like when your makeup and your clothes are a little matchy matchy? All right, so I got the perfect combo for you. This is part three of our two shade eyeshadow series. Yes, it works for hooded eyes. Let me show you. If you picked up basic, this mid-tone matte from last week's eyeshadow look, luck, look, well you are in luck because we're gonna use it again. So we are going in that crease and up onto the base of the hood, right? This is how we get a hooded eye to be open. We create that new crease. Now I'm just tapping a little bit here in the outer corner and using the big fluffy brush as always. This is the eyeshadow brush. It's the only brush we're using for this series. There we go. First shade is done on the lid. Now let's put a little under the eye. We're gonna halo it. Use this instead of eyeliner to keep it soft, no harsh lines. I'm kind of bringing it up and just connecting it connecting everything. Make sure we're blend, blend? Oh my gosh, words are hard. Make sure we are blended. Now, let's go to Kiss. Kiss is our shade of the month. It's just this pretty peachy coral. Here, look. I have a little bit of ruby on the lips topped with La Cienega. Isn't this so pretty all together? This is Kiss. You can also wear it just more sheer. Well, maybe not that sheer. Just a little pop of color there. I'm gonna use my finger to press it onto the lid. One, I get a little bit of better payoff with that color, and it tends not to fall underneath, which I don't like. All right, let me finish up this eye, and then we'll do a final blend. Okay, I made mine a little bit bolder. I was just feeling a little bit bold today. Now let's just make sure that it's all blended together. So I just tapped back into that basic went over that crease where it connects to the hood, swirled it in the outer corner. Key to a good, a good eyeshadow look is a good blend. It's like you don't wanna be able to tell where any one thing starts or stops. Okay, now we're gonna flip it over and remember, I said you were gonna to need to grab a light and bright shade. So grab either your light and bright eyeshadow or your illuminator. Okay, my ride or die brightening shade is Drift. Press it onto that tear duct not too far this way, then it's gonna emphasize your texture underneath the brow. Also really helps with a hooded eye. Okay, we're gonna finish this up with mascara. If you struggle with your lashes growing and you've tried a lash serum that you put on your lash line and it turned your lash line purple, that's me. It worked really well, but it turned my lash line purple. This is Quadra. It's a tubing mascara, which means it comes off easily with water, which is great for lashes that aren't strong so you don't pull them out, but it also has lash growth serum and it's an awesome mascara. Let me show you. Okay, these are my lashes with it. These are my lashes without it. And I did not use my lash curler today or it would even be more amazing. So this so replaces your mascara, an eyelash primer and a growth serum. And it's half the cost of what my old growth serum alone that dyed my eyelid used to be. Final look. What do you guys think? Are you loving Kiss? Okay, if you need links to any of the products, just DM me. I'll be happy to hook you up with whatever it is that you're looking for. And do not forget to follow for our next two shade eyeshadow look. Oh, and if you have a friend that would love easy eyeshadow, share it with her.